Yo, 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 what up, what up, what up? It's your boy Ty X Worldwide. Now check this out. Just cause a woman flirt with you does not mean she like you. Let's go to the TikTok video. She said, me ignoring the guy I was flirting with the other night when I was bored and vulnerable. See, this is what a lot of women do. They'll flirt with you, make you feel good, make you think they really like you, but deep down inside, they really have no interest to in you. This is why I tell you guys, you got to be direct with them. This is why I'm doing all that flirting, all that playing and all that. I don't be doing that stuff because that's what these women good at. They good at flirting with you. They good at telling you what you want to hear and you be falling for that, eating it all up. But meanwhile, she have no real interest in you. And I used to fall for this all the time. I used to think that we was having a good vibe. Everything is going smooth. You know, somebody then I later on hit her up and she leave me on red and ignore me and I'll be left clueless like what you was just on me hard you was feeling me like what what happened like like how you just ghost me like that but this is how they operate man because they good at doing this this is they trick they they flirt with you because they be bored I keep telling you a lot of these women be bored they don't really be doing nothing with their life and they look at you as entertainment I keep telling you that a woman look at you as entertainment her making you think you gonna get some is a game that's the game they like to play they like to make you think you gonna get some make you think it's gonna lead up to somewhere and she just cut it off like nope we ain't doing that that's fun to them they, they, they get a rush off that this is why I tell you guys once you meet a chick you can't be playing no games you gotta be direct with them this is why I tell you guys about being direct never kiki ha ha and all that joking stuff no get straight to the point they will have you thinking one thing and it's a whole nother this is why i don't play no games i'm straight to the point shorty what it is i done had chicks that tell me oh you so fine you so this oh i can't wait to get with you or talking all this type of talk but when it came time to make it happen they flaked out they play games this is why i don't buy any of that stuff they say i don't yo listen here bro when it comes to that flirting stuff and that flattery, I, I don't buy any of that. I'm like, yo, shorty, yeah, yeah, whatever. I, I hear you. Ah, right, yeah, whatever. The only time I believe you is when you're in my crib and you open up your legs. I don't believe anything else. Like, all that, oh, you so this, and oh, I really like you. You're just so special. That's all bull crap. I keep telling you, bro. That is all cap. I do not let women use me for entertainment. I don't play them games. Shorty, what it is? We're going to get it down. We're going to get it popping or what? I don't let women play with me. I don't let women toy with me. I ain't, I don't do none of that. I'm going to keep it 100 with you. A lot of women not going to like when you direct. Because when you direct with them, they can't manipulate you. They, they can't play with you. They can't do any of that. And a lot of women like to do that. Matter of fact, let's go back to the TikTok video again. How much time do you think that dude wasted flirting with that girl? How much time do you think he wasted? He probably was sitting there all night talking to her, thinking he running some type of game. Meanwhile, she don't even like this dude like that. She's like, what? This, you were just for that night. I was just trying to have fun with you. And little did he know he was getting played the whole time. Me being direct with women saved me so much time. And I get to weed them all out. I get to see the ones that really like me and the ones that really don't. When you direct, they can't play with you. They can't manipulate you. They can't do any of that. You ain't going to waste all your time. You ain't going to be upset. You ain't going to be frustrated. This is why I don't do no flirting because flirting only benefits a woman. She gets free attention, free validation. She get all that stuff. But what do you get out of that? You don't get nothing out of flirting. This is why I don't do it. I don't waste my time flirting. Hey, look, shorty, we're going to have a conversation. We're going to fill each other out. And after that, we're going to try to make things happen. If you're not trying to do that, bye. I'm moving on to the next one. I'm not about to sit up there and flirt with you and do all this stuff because you don't benefit from that as a man. I keep telling you guys, I live my life black and white. It's either this or that. Ain't no in between. Ain't no gray area. None of that stuff. This is what it's going to be. And if you ain't trying to rock with it, bounce. But we're not about to sit up here and play no games because flirting is like the gray area with women. You never know which one you're going to get. It can you always lean this way. It can always lean that way. No. This is what it's going to be. This is what it's not going to be. I have this coworker that like has a crush on me and like sometimes he'll come in on his off days and like sit in my section and you know leave like a twenty dollar tip on like a three dollar tab. Which is like okay, all fun and games. We we could do that. But then um recently he actually sat down and told me he liked me because you know there's a lot of just catty games. Everybody like, oh yeah, the girl, he likes you, I know he does. And so um he finally sat me down, he was like, sorry. I let him know, not really, not necessarily. And so he goes, well, you know, I'm just interested in you. I, I love your accent. I'm like, my accent? He's like, yeah, you got an accent, you know, because I've been to the ghetto, and they just got a special way they talk. The ghetto? Excuse me? And so I'm like, okay. Then he's like, yeah, you know, I just love how aggressive you are, just the way you speak, you carry yourself, like your hair is always changed. Okay. Guys, listen up. Women don't respect guys who give them all these compliments and tell them what they want to hear because they know it's all bull crap. They know deep down inside, you're just saying all these things to get in their pants. And here's the thing. Women know they're not all that special. They know they have all these flaws. They're very insecure. So when you tell them that, they're like, wait, what? How you not, how you see me like this? Because I know what I see when I look in the mirror. This is why I tell you guys, women never respect the man who puts them on a pedestal because they know deep, deep down inside, 
that's not how they really feel. Women respect the man who views himself as the prize, who puts himself on the pedestal. Once you start doing all that simping, putting her on the pedestal, she will never respect you and she will never give you none, but she will use you just like that woman did in that video, using that guy for his money, using him for his tips, but deep down inside, she know that dude like her, but she will never give him none. Why? Because it's a benefit to that. Get ready with me while I tell you some of my red flags in a guy. Always wanting me to initiate a conversation or we won't talk. If a man is interested in you, he will call, text you, or be in your face. A man who won't spoil you or has a problem with buying you stuff, especially if you guys are going out to eat. Stop having bills. A man who acts like he is the prize. A man who doesn't follow you on any social medias. That just proves to me that you are not actually interested in me and that you just want to see if I'll respond and if I don't, it's just like a precaution. A guy who doesn't text you good morning, good night, or ask about how your day is. Someone who doesn't compliment you. You do not need to be getting hard eyes once or twice here and there. You need to get verbal compliments, if not every day, 80% of the time. Going the whole day without talking to me because we always have our phones, even if we're working. I cannot stress this one enough because a lot of guys want to debate about this. Being friends with your ex, please leave me alone, sir. I do not tolerate that. I don't care. Being annoying, and I can't help this one. Learn when to be quiet. Being toxic past the age of 18, it just looks dumb. Being confused about where we stand or what our situation is. If I have to ask you what we are doing or where we're going, I am just going to go stand by another man. A man who isn't always checking in on you and just wanting to be in the mix because he's in love with you. Sir, one is athlete edition sending me emojis when you first try to talk to me. Sir, come correct. I'm not getting you flowers ever. Like, I don't care if they're from the Dollar Tree. You're getting some. Not responding fast if we're having a disagreement, I'm going to assume what I'm talking about is just not important to you. Not showing me who your ex is. I want to see if I'm doing charity work. Acting nonchalant after a certain age, it's like you're too old for that. Not being able to communicate and act like an adult. A lot of men like this and they want to act toxic. Expecting something sexual on the first dates. You might get a kiss goodbye, but that's if you get charisma. Emphasis on the might. Not being able to show you any test results before he tries to kiss you, touch you, or do anything sexual with you. Go to the clinic. Lastly, not treating me like a princess because how can I treat you like a prince if you're not really giving me the treatment I need and deserve as a woman? Therefore, I gotta treat you like a peasant. And if any of these apply to you, change them now because yeah. Guys, you want to avoid women like this because women like this just want to have power over you. They want to control you and they just want you to bow down to them. That's what it boils down to. They just want you to bow down to them and submit to them and they want to treat you like a peasant. This is why I tell you guys, it's very important that you have self-respect because if you don't, you'll be dealing with women like this. Bottom line, guys, just focus on yourself and continue to elevate and only deal with the women that want to deal with you. Point blank, period, all right? It's your boy, Ty X Worldwide, man. I hope you got the message in this video. Just like all my videos, there is a message in there. Y'all already know what to do, man. Like, comment, subscribe. Get with y'all another time.